Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa Arma with the Stock Swoosh, and guess what? I'm here today with the gap, the number one gap that I like this morning to trade, and I did it, and I was up, and I didn't get out of it, and now it's working. Can you believe it? Why? Why is it working? <laughs> because, because it rated over 20 points. That's why. Per the Golden Gap rating system, Twitter was a short. And trainers, for some reason unknown to me, were trying to buy this this morning. And I'll go over the trade, but it's really interesting because before I close out the room today, I said, here it goes. Here it goes. Twitter's going to go down and break the loan. Go and break $16. You can do it again here late if you feel like sitting here all day. And, and, it, and it did it. It went, broke, broke the low, went to 16 set up again, and now it's going to continue. Incredible. But I will tell you that many traders probably went long in this morning into Twitter, into the 50 period moving average support. It was a short, but it was, it was a scalp short for the quick trade. The longer, smoother ride happens to be right now and was the late morning. It's unusual, but it was a weird placement where this opened in the morning. So many day traders looked to go long it, but the train was a short. It was a short, it is a short. Why? Because the Golden Gap rating system told me it would be sold off today with institutional money. And that is what's happening or it would not be red. It was a pain in the butt though this morning. I'll tell you that it was jumping. Anyways, let's look at it. So here's where it opened. Unfortunately, this rally did not happen immediately. So what happened is that it set up and dropped first. Went to a baby target, flipped, set up late. This move over the high, 1659. Let's just look where that is. See, this was nothing. Nothing of any significance at all. It just was annoying. And traders tried to buy it in the morning. It got halted here instead of the lower level. And then it broke. And you see it did break 16. And it's, this is still going to go. 1575 today in this, 1560 when it breaks the low. And you still got time. If, if anybody in the room redid this, the second trade was here. Boom. You could have done it into 1030. You could have done another one here. Boom. And you were still in it. I didn't go back after this. And I'll tell you what I did. I don't like trading late. I also am in a great Google trade. So I felt no reason to jump back into this today, but I did tell the room they could do it. Here's what I did. I got in the trade right here, had to stop at 1645, 1646, gave it one more penny, drop rope, was going to get out of it at 16, bounced back so fast I couldn't get out of it. Couldn't get out of any of it, was going to take some out. Didn't, didn't get out. Didn't get out, and I was patient, waited, waited, waited. This looked great. This looked perfect. This was fine. This was amazing. I actually ended up taking a loss in this today because I missed the exit in here. And I was paying attention. It just bounced very fast. So I took a loss in this, but I could have I could have retaken it. I could have retaken it, and I could have retaken it. And I not only would I have been gotten back the money for the loss, I would have been up. And it wasn't a lack of conviction that made me not want to do this. I would have never told the room they could do this when we were setting up and I was still talking at 10 o'clock. It was the fact that I didn't want to be heavy-handed today. I absolutely want to just take it easy today, not be heavy-handed. This was a top watch this morning, and so was the ACAM was a top watch this morning. And this was the faster, quicker mover this morning, and it just fell completely, totally out of the gate. So very quickly here, I'm going to go over this one. Again, this rated well, too. It was 21 points. Stock, open, bounce, dropped, broke. This is it. This is the move. This is the move right into the open in here. I said 48 today. This could go to dream target. Did it get there? Yep, it did. 47.86 is the low in here. But anyways, this was the morning move. So this had the faster mover, bigger mover, ACAN, rather than Twitter today for the short, quick out of the gate. But they both were short. They both rated good for the system. And you could have done both. And you could have done multiple trades in both of them. I just was looking for a bigger move faster with Twitter. I just liked the fast, quick moves, and it wasn't Twitter this morning. It was it was ACAM. Although Twitter had the move into the first number, it just had the bounce back fast. This had more of a slow, slow road to China kind of move. This is still going. Let me just look at this really quickly here and see. This isn't over either. So you could be, you, this is very strange, very unusual, but you could be actually short Twitter in the afternoon, and you could be short ACAM in the afternoon if you felt like it. But remember, the minutes today are at 2 o'clock. So if you're in something during that time, you almost have to have a trailing stop or be very tight with what you're doing and don't have a big position. 
So all in all, there was a lot to look at today. Tons of things to do. The fastest mover was ACAM. You could have done them both. I rated them both. I put them both in the room. Twitter was a morning scalp. Lower trade, better trade, longer move was in the afternoon. Either way, they're both short. And how did I know that? Because of the 26-point rating system. So we'll see what we get tomorrow. Um, into a groove here now, and I'm just paying attention and watching my Google. I'm going to do a separate video on that. Have a great night, everyone. Email me at melissa at thestockpush.com if you want more information on the class this weekend. It's to learn how to predict what direction something will go because I correctly predicted ACAM. I correctly predicted Twitter. I correctly predicted the market. And this is how you make money. So you, you can do it. This is not beyond the realm of comprehension of a human being on the planet. You can do this because I do it every day. So have a great day, everyone. And again, the next class is this weekend.